Nuclear weapons are the most powerful weapons in the world, capable of unleashing untold devastation. But, well, they aren't launched from the labs where they're made, so how do they get from point A to point B? Well, rather mundanely, the same way that anything gets anywhere, a combination of long-haul trucking and planes. The difference is that nuclear bombs are transported by the National Nuclear Security Administration, and instead of a single truck driver, there's a team of federal agents who all share the roles of driving communications and security. These agents must already either have military or law enforcement experience before applying to one of the trans transport jobs and it requires months of additional training. There's also a lot more secrecy involved when a truck's cargo is five nuclear bombs rather than a trailer full of marshmallow peeps. But the key isn't in transporting the bombs, it's in building them. The basic design of the weapons makes them difficult to accidentally detonate, and additional failsafes and redundancies have made it nearly impossible. So there's actually very little danger in transporting nuclear bombs like any other cargo. They obviously just require a lot more security, so someone doesn't nick them. 